Southern Sardinia has always proved a stunning area for sailing and has become well known with the Italian Luna Rossa America's Cup Challenger based nearby. However, the first time Villa Simus in the southernmost tip of the Italian island ever hosted a major sailing regatta was last year with the 2017 GC32 Villa Simus Cup. Such was its popularity that the GC32 Racing Tour has returned for a second consecutive year. Sardinia is one of the best places for sailing. It's a beautiful island and it's very renowned for sailing. We have many regattas up north and here in the south, in Cagliari, there's also the base of the Italian America's Cup team from Luna Rossa, uh, Prada. And uh, we really wanted to go to Sardinia and we found a beautiful spot here in Villa Simius, very close to Cagliari where we can have our racing. The first day of the GC32 Villa Simeus Cup was full of challenges for the teams with light winds to start with. Two races were sailed until the wind suddenly grew to 25 knots, forcing the race committee to abandon the rest of the day's racing and send the GC32 fleet ashore. Before racing got underway, the teams contested the Anonimo Speed Challenge. In this, real team were the fastest. When it came to racing, Frank Camus's Nor Auto did well to prevail over Ineos and Real Team to win race one. In race two, Real Team again won the start, but this time they clung on to claim race two in a building breeze. I think we worked well. The crew did a you know, very good job, as always, and the boat is well prepared, so we could uh, sail without thinking too much about the. Um, the boat and everything. So we kept on sailing and racing uh, for the two races um, and I think the um, race committee probably did the right thing to send us all back um, to shore. Let's have a look then at the leaderboard after day one. It could hardly be any closer with the top four teams all within one point of each other. Three, two, one, good angle. 